Thank you, sweetheart. For the McBride family, fishing at Tripod Reservoir means catching a few of the 4,000 trout stocked every year. Well, the main reason to have a hatchery program in the first place is so that people can catch fish and take them home. Idaho Fish and Game has planted millions of fertile hatchery rainbow trout over the last century. Hatchery fish are important. A lot of areas get so much pressure from the public that we still need to put those there to provide a fishing opportunity. The benefits are obvious, but hatchery trout have caused problems too. What we've learned over time is that some of those past practices have led to the hatchery trout hybridizing with our native trout, some places displacing and sometimes completely replacing the native trout. Laboratory research on sterile trout offered a possible solution. What we didn't know uh, at that time was whether these sterile fish were gonna work for sport fisheries. Uh, were the anglers gonna be able to catch them? Were they gonna survive? Uh, how were they gonna perform in the wild? Once Fish and Game fine-tuned the steps to mass-produce sterile eggs, researchers tested the adults' catchability. We've looked at the sterile fish versus the normal fish in lakes and in streams. In every situation where we've compared the two, the, the sterile fish have done just as well, they've grown just as fast, and more importantly, the anglers are catching just as many of them. By 2001, Fish and Game was stocking sterile rainbow trout. So it's really a win-win situation. We're, we're providing for the anglers and at the same time we're conserving our wild trout that are native to Idaho. Michael Keckler, Idaho Fish and Game.